In this video, I just want to show you how to activate, how to turn on Apple Intelligent on your iPhone 16. This also works with the 16 Plus, Pro and Pro Max. So go ahead and launch the settings. Once you're over here, you're going to go down, go in general, then software update. And here, wait a few seconds. And you need to make sure that your iPhone does not have any update pending. So right over here I have one but there's not enough space on my iPhone. I need to clear the space to be able to install the last version of iOS. This is very important. If not, it will not work. Next step, once uh, you have installed the last update, again in settings, this is the main menu of settings, go down until you see Apple Intelligence and Siri. And over here, you need to click on join the Apple Intelligence waitlist. Um, you won't have it directly. You first need to apply to get it. So you're going to click here and then you're going to click on join waitlist. If you didn't see, by the way, this button, join the waitlist, you first need to set the language to English United States. I had it set at English Canada before and it didn't allow me. But once I switched to English United States, it worked. I don't know why, but this is how it is. Anyway, now we just need to wait a few hours until we are approved. But this is mostly a question of time. So I'll come back when I'll be notified that I've been approved. Again, don't worry, you're gonna be approved if you have the last iOS and you're running your um, this on your iPhone 16. Okay, so after a few hours, if you go back into the settings of your iPhone, you go down and you're going to select again, Apple Intelligence and Siri. This time over here, you're going to see that there is Apple Intelligence with a small toggle. It's turned off. You just have to click on it to enable it. Obviously, right now, at the time of making this video, we are in November 2024. It's only beta. This is why you see beta. It's not like the full version with all the uh, full features that you'll have access. So maybe some stuff will have some bugs. Some stuff will work better than others. But overall, this is how you access Apple intelligence on your iPhone 16. Um, I think in my case, it took about four or five hours to get accepted. Uh, as long as you make sure that over language, you have English United States, I think you should good you should be good to go. So thanks for watching. I hope this was helpful and uh, like, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.